Tim Hortons. <laughs> Yum. <laughs> We're back at it again. This is what, our like fourth trip to Tim Hortons? Yeah. Only our second for breakfast, though. <laughs> you guys, it's not an addiction. It's just that we won't be able to get it once we get to Alaska. So we have to like completely get ourselves sick of it now. Does that make sense? So, first of all, I promise that I'm wearing a clean shirt under this every day, but it's cold up here and I didn't pack any warm enough clothes. So it looks like I'm wearing the same outfit every day, but I'm not, I'm just wearing the same sweatshirt every day. So that's the first thing I wanna say. We are leaving Fort Nelson this morning. It's turkey. We're leaving Fort Nelson and headed to Watson Lake. It's a six and a half, almost seven hour drive, but we have two um, stops along the way, Toad River and Muncho Lake, and they're supposed to be really beautiful. So we're gonna stop, take some video, take some pictures, and break up our trip a little bit that way. You guys, the people in front of us in the Tim Hortons drive-thru paid for our meal. I thought that was so nice. Herc, it's so nice. So, six hours and 46 minutes and 316 miles until we get to Watson Lake, Yukon Territory. Yesterday, when we got to the hotel, we ate a little bit and then Brian wanted to just kind of like rest and relax, but I wanted to go to the post office and do some other, like just check out the town. So, I he went to the hotel and just relaxed and I kind of drove around and I went to the post office and mailed some things and um, I told when I walked up I told the lady at the post office that I didn't know like what sort of postage I needed specifically because I wasn't from here and so she says so she says where are you from and I said oh well we're from the US and she's like oh really what brings you up here I said well we're driving to Alaska because we're moving there sorry I'm burping. <laughs> and we're driving to Alaska because we're moving there and she said oh so you just got on the Alcan Highway I said yeah and she said I said it was really beautiful our drive was really nice and she said oh my gosh you haven't even gotten to the most beautiful part yet so I'm really excited to see today's scenery and see how beautiful it gets and I've kind of looked at the map and it kind of looks like we're snaking through some really pretty stuff so I'm excited for that um anything else you want to add no just another day of driving tell them about your breakfast I did have a specialty bagel sandwich and the bagel was a three cheese bagel and it was probably the best bagel I've ever had <laughs> I've been getting maple dip donuts, which if you know me, that's not very much of a surprise. That's pretty far for the course. <laughs> that's what I've gotten, except for when we went for lunch. That's what I've gotten every, no, only, even when. Only because you didn't get the maple dip, you got the maple cream filled <laughs> on accident. I didn't realize it was cream filled and I don't like cream filled. But yeah, every time I've ordered a maple donut, whatever, I don't even care. I love maple donuts. And when we get to Alaska, we are getting strict on what we eat. So, might as well live it up now, right? Um, I've been getting maple dip donuts, but I think if we come upon another Tim Hortons, I think I'm going to have to get that three cheese. Four cheese? Three cheese. I think I'm going to have to get that three cheese bagel, y'all. Well, I mean, technically, if you got the piece of cheese on the sausage, it was four cheese. But... That was just yeah. plastic cheese. That wasn't real cheese. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna have to get that next time because it was good. It was really good. All right, off we go. It's gonna be a longer drive today, but after this, it's short drives. I think the next one is like what five hours? Four or five. Four yeah. or five, and then our last day is like four and a half to get to the base. So it's all right. We're gonna we're gonna be fine. Somebody has a birthday coming up. Not me. I already had my birthday. Kirk already had his birthday. Your birthday's coming up! He doesn't know what we're doing because it's a surprise. I'm not sure that I know 100% <laughs> what we're doing because we're going to be in Whitehorse, Yukon. 
so it might just be like whatever's there but I do have a plan just in case Perky anything you want to say did you travel dog did you travel dog well my doggy project's kicking in I can barely keep my eyes open oh he's so tired oh tired doggy so it is almost 9 a.m. We've been stopped for 20 minutes, you think? Yeah, I'm like 10, 15. Oh, it seems like longer to me, I guess. Um, for construction, we've had quite a bit of construction, but I don't think we've been stopped this long the whole time. So we started the, well, we're listening to it, we're not reading it, the Five Love Languages book pretty good so far we're ready to get past like the anecdotal stuff and more into the actual love languages because right now he's just talking about love and how we fall in love and we have a love obsession and it lasts this amount of time and all that so Kirky's looking out the window into the into nature he's really tired because he's doped up but he won't go to sleep I've been holding him and petting him and rocking him and he won't go to sleep. How's it going, Flash? It's going pretty slow. <laughs> We're not going at all. Bison people, do you see 
all of those bison. Bison? That bison was nursing. Baby bison. Bison. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. The coolest part of that is that not even a mile before that, well, it's maybe two miles before that, Brian saw one, just one, on the side of the road. And he said, look, there's a buffalo, or a bison. And I was like, oh my gosh. And I was like, that's really cool. It was so big. I was like, I want to see more. I want to see more. And I told him, like, a mile before that herd of, buff uh, that herd of bison, I said, I want to see more. And <laughs> you're so sweet. Try. I don't know what he had to do to get those buffalo just to be there when I said I wanted to see them, but sweet husband. <laughs> anyway, that was cool. They were everywhere. That was so neat. Here's some more. Got some pretty interesting wallpaper in here. Uh, no, so. <laughs> I like that the TV is at the top of the waterfall. <laughs> 